Now, while bars are mandated to remain closed, many of them have reopened without breaking any rules. They are working with the TABC to amend their license, allowing them to open as a restaurant. Dana Morris joins us now with more on what resources are available for business owners considering this alternative. Yeah, it's a big day for businesses, including restaurants across Texas, as they're able to crank up to that 75% of maximum capacity. But as far as bars, they're seemingly still left behind by the governor's latest executive order, still being asked to stay closed unless they're able to reclassify as a restaurant. But there are resources available both from the TABC and locally here from the Chamber of Commerce. So let's go ahead and take a look at what those are. For bars across Texas, the governor's latest executive order does them no favors. It's either stay closed, open and face fines, or reinvent their booze business. So for those wanting to play by the rules, the Texas TABC is requiring owners to reclassify their business as a restaurant. That means food on a menu, reduced alcohol sales, and filing the proper paperwork. Though the Texas TABC is trying to make that tedious filing easier. On their website, under a coronavirus tab, you'll find all of the organization's up-to-date information, including a quick link to the application business owners need to reclassify. As for bar owners who need to source some food, you may want to consider stopping by the Chamber of Commerce. If there's a business out there that's having some difficulty, please come see us, uh, come visit with us, and let's see how we can help them out together. From developing relationships within the community and tapping into community resources, the Chamber's experts are problem solvers. We have many restaurants that could benefit to partner up with a, a type of bar industry and um, you know, offer something to new customers. And, and that way it's a win-win for everyone. So the main message here, with a little food and friends, hopefully everyone can get back on their feet and back to doing the things they love. You can find a link to the Texas TABC and Odessa Chamber of Commerce if you click the link to this story on NewsWest9.com. Reporting in Odessa, Dana Morris, NewsWest9.